Hey everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips, and in this video we're going to be talking about how to set up Plex Media Server. I'm running Fedora, but that doesn't matter because we have an article that lists every single different kind of... But that doesn't matter because I'm... Because we have an article in the description that will tell you how to install this software on any Linux distribution. So to start off, just search Plex Media Server Linux. And this will show you the installation and it'll show you a bunch of stuff. What you really need to click on is download Plex Media Server. And then from there, obviously click the download button. And this will tell you to choose your platform. In our case, it's going to be Linux. Now we need to choose our distribution. So I am on Fedora 64 bit. So I'm going to select this. If you're using something else, select it through here. But once you click the download button, it will save a package. And we can let this package download. And then once it's downloaded, we can go ahead and open it and install it. Now there are multiple ways to install Plex Media Server and RPMs in general. But for the sake of speed, I'm going to do it the GUI way. So you find the RPM, right click, and click open with software install. This will bring up the GNOME software tool and from here you can just click the install button, enter your password, and get going. So once Plex is ready to go, what you need to do to get it installed is you need to do 127.0.0.1 slash web. This is all covered in the article. And uh, there are also some systemd commands you'll need to use. That's also in the article. Once you've done that, you can go here. This will load and you can click sign in and this will find your server and it will get everything up and running so that we can add media. So the server setup process is very simple. It's perhaps the easiest way to add media. So it's gonna ask you to set up a name I'm going to name mine test. You can name it whatever you'd like. Once you've done that, click next and you can go to organize your media. Click add library and then select the category that you'd like to add. I have lots of different media, but for the sake of example, I'm just going to select TV shows. Now I click next and then I click browse for media. So you can go through your library and you can select individual things. You can also add a media server if you'd like. And once you do that, it'll scan for TV shows and it will look for everything that it needs. And you can just do for every individual thing. And once you're done, click the next button. It'll pitch you to install Plex apps if you want to get it on your iPhone, your iPad, your Android devices, your game consoles, and so forth. You just click the Get Plex App button to do that. And then once you're done with all that, click the Done button. So guys, Plex is all up and running. Uh, my media still isn't showed up, but that's not really the important part. The important part is showing you how to get this all up and running. So I hope this video has been informative, and I will see you next time.